Judge Creek has completed her placings in the summer yearling class. Would all juniors please step forward to be recognized? Second place junior is entry 108. PNA Superior Remedy, exhibited by Tom, Sarah, Caleb, Cole, and Carter Cruzy of Dyersville, Iowa. First place junior is entry 111, Maple Dell D. Gale, exhibited by Alexis Winkler, Woodbine, Maryland. Placing third in the class is entry 109, Old Bankston J.C. Malibu, exhibited by Michelle and Melissa Downard of Prospect, Ohio. Placing second in the class is entry 110, MJH Riggins Teagan, exhibited by Mike and Julie Hemp of Beaverville, Illinois. And the winning entry and first bread and known, entry 114, Park View Colors Opportunity Gina, exhibited by Garrett and Kelly Howinski, Pulaski, Wisconsin. Congratulations. <laughs> Judge your comments. Uh, in this class, uh, if you've been paying attention, you've noticed we've made quite a few changes as we went up through the line. Um, a, a lot of nice heifers. Okay, okay it's back. Um, a lot of heifers that, that have different qualities to them. So it was a little bit more difficult to evaluate and sort it out. We did stick from the very beginning with this pair of heifers that we've started the class with. Both very correct, very straight-topped heifers, extremely feminine, dairy, angular, um, opened-ribbed heifers, um, but we did switch it here near the end. And we went with the heifers a little more upsetting, a, a little more uh, stretch, uh, a little more youthful to her appearance. I just love the openness of rib, the depth, the body that we have here on this second heifer, but she doesn't track quite as nicely on those rear legs as we have in the heifer in first. The second heifer is just a little uh, smoother and tighter up through that shoulder, uh, but a tremendous pair of heifers, and, and I'm certainly very proud of both of them and, and very pleased to have them as class winners today. Then second over third, a heifer that is straighter out over the top line. She's more snug and smooth in that shoulder. She's fuller in the crop, stronger in the chine, wider on the floor of the chest, showing more depth and openness of both fore and rear rib uh, than this beautiful stylish heifer leading out in third. The third heifer over the one and fourth because of the advantage in that openness of rib and depth and spring of rear rib um, that we have over this really tall, long-bodied heifer leading out in fourth. The fourth heifer over the fifth one, the fourth heifer another one that we worked through and moved up um, throughout the class. Um, but she stands forth because of the advantage in length of body. She's deeper in the heart. She's wider on the floor of the chest uh, than we have in the, the uh, fifth heifer. She's also um, a, a stronger, more, more uh, powerful heifer in that front end than the fifth heifer. Then fifth over six, a heifer that blends more smoothly, holds herself together more nicely up through the front end, and tracks more correctly on the rear legs. <laughs> 